What's up, guys? It's Laughing Stock, host of Weekly Battlefeed on Ruin Your Day, and you're watching Witty Titty News. Said I'm a rapper, nick. Yeah. Too dapper, nigga, to dapper, nick. Round of applause, right to your jaws. That's the way that I clap in that. Fuck a battle, I take it in three. Tuck with the blade that the nigga ain't see. Reach out and send the nigga face to his ear. No feel like a nigga AT and T, but shit. I'm straight posted though. Yeah, it just goes to show. I ain't gotta ask no dumbass questions. Christian Smith, Woody Spitty News. Join with the girl Yasmin. Got your Hello. first. It, well. I guess all your opponents are pretty much international opponents, but <laughs> yeah. First American opponent coming up, Ace Boogie. First girl since your debut. Talk first about black it. person. Are you ready? I think so. Yeah. So how's how's the prep been? Um, it's been pretty good. I've been working on switching up my references. I'm not going to do like all name flips. That was just you know an experiment. I don't really think, I really don't think her writing is all of that, but she has good performance. So I'm just stepping up my performance even more than last time. Now, you mentioned in the last interview we did, it d doesn't really matter for you if you're battling a girl, battling a guy. Yeah. So do you prefer battling girls or do you prefer battling guys as opposed to which is harder? I mean... See, the, th the thing is, like, the audience is still going to be the same, so I can't exactly talk about Barbies for the for all three rounds. Yeah, that's a fact. If, I, if there was, like, a Queen of the Ring or a different, or, like, what is it, bars and bra straps type situation, then I could change the content. But because it's the same audience, I don't really think it matters that much. Mm. Now, with her, she's from Detroit. you seen how you watch all her battles, I'm assuming? Yeah. What well, I saw... What stood out to you from her besides the performance? Was there a certain battle that stood out? Not really, because, <laughs> <laughs> I mean, like, she she's had some issues with stumbling and choking, and not all of her opponents were the best. It's not like she was up against someone that was so amazing. I, I think maybe Looney Bars was her best opponent so far. Which was her first battle, too, I'm pretty sure. So that tells you something. <laughs> <laughs> now, you like to kind of usually have a scheme where it kind of relates to your opponent or kind of a theme behind it. You did it with yeah. the don't flop thing. Can we expect <laughs> something something like that again in this battle? Yeah, um, I'm going to try and not make them as long and try and have them a little more punchy, but... Yeah, I like schemes. It's kind of how I started writing for battles, because it's like a word puzzle. Mm. So I, just, I like to do that and then build around it. So let's get into some predictions. The whole card's pretty pretty fire. Yeah. Battle of the night. Probably the main event. Mm. Eleven, yeah, Eleven Marv's going to be fucking crazy. Yeah. Performance of the night. Um, I'm probably going to have to say Lev or me. Depending. Thank you. You're only the <laughs> second person to say yourself. I don't know why more people aren't saying themselves. It doesn't make any sense. Well, yeah, realism is it's not a bad thing to have. So. <laughs> a body of the night. I'm aiming for that. Like, I don't know. People say think it's going to be a two one. It's going to be debatable. I don't. I don't see how. Mm. Just don't. See, so you're very confident this time. I was told it's important, and I just, I don't know, like, her writing just doesn't speak to me, so maybe it's a preference thing, like, if you don't, if you are more, you know, if you like Shotgun Shug, then maybe you'll like her, but that's not my style, so. Surprise the night. Uh, Apex is just, because a lot of people were questioning him, mm. so, like, if, the, if if you weren't there in the alley, you don't know what it's, what it really is about. <laughs> Oh We're on the street with Apex, you don't know. But we the real ones know. Yeah, that battle was fire too, by the way. Exactly. <laughs> Shout exactly. out to Apex and Joey. So if the battle goes good, you do what you think you're gonna do, you get body of the night, what's next? Who who do you think? You need to step up in competition, you wanna battle another girl, battle another guy? Again, I don't really care about the gender. Just wanna elevate if I can, you know, 
go to like if I if I could go to don't flop like my life would be made like I had a whole don't flop scheme for no reason basically just because I like it so much um or like no coast or anywhere you know where the crowd is a little more lighthearted. Mm. I'd like to try and write more jokes if I can see if I can still get the same like level of punches but yeah any anyone that you know be small thinks is suitable for me I'm, I'm down to kill them all right well April 1st Yasmin versus Ace Boogie, Lev Corso versus Marv One, J.O. versus Quest. The whole card is fucking stacked. Shout out to the girls, man. You guys are not at the bottom of the card, not at the middle. You're closer yeah, to the AJ. top. Yeah, fuck AJ. Fuck AJ for what he said. <laughs> You're God. closer to the top. It's well deserved. Appreciate it. April 1st, 158, Kensington Ave. Or Kensington Augusta Market, Ave. Augusta Ave, sorry. 158 Augusta Ave, Kensington Market. 2 to 10 p.m., be on fucking time. $20 pre-sales, get that shit. Yasmin, I'll see you there. I'm going to do a prediction blog for this one, actually. I don't usually do them, but I'm going to do I'm gonna do one this time. You're going to make some new enemies. Good luck. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's a fact. That's a fact. Well, what do you see news, Yasmin? We have <laughs> Even your mama listening to that <laughs> shit. <laughs> 3-0 radio. Witty Schmitty news, motherfuckers. Get it right. <laughs>